after being hassled for so long by this country, I'm really interested to know what is it about America that makes you want to stay here so bad? I think, uh, you know, if there's any hope in the world, uh, America's it. However, you know, however much bad side it has, like, it, it's only like human beings, you know, we're not, we're not saints. And if there's anything cooking or any hope in the world, America has it, and uh, it has the energy and, and everything else, and that's why I want to be here. I feel comfortable here. Luckily, I speak the same language almost. So I really feel at home here. I never really felt a stranger. Even one, you know, the music is international. It's a, that's another cliche, but it's true. And American music was what I was brought up on. I feel quite, it feels quite natural for me to be here. And it's the only unnatural happening is that they keep telling me to leave. You know, there's a lot of folks in this country who I think would do something to help you right now if they only knew what to do. Well, look, how much can the public do? It's, very, it's confusing for them to follow what's going on as it is. Because, like a, a cab driver will say, Hey, John, you still here? I thought they threw you out. You know, or, good luck with the fight. You know, they, they know something's going on. And they're probably more aware of it in New York because that's where it's all been going on. So, if, if that kind of public, they support me, but the taxi cab driver is not, driver's not going to write a letter to his congressman or something. But, uh, sort of spiritually, they support me because mo most comments to me are about that on the street, you know, from all age groups. And a lot of people have written to me or sent petitions to different places, and I appreciate it, and I thank them for it.